Right, okay. So, like, if it is fair enough that, like, he, like, at least, uh, I don't know, like, if Chief Gant was, you know, drunk on chlorine fumes and did all of this murder rampage uh, and then just tried to blame his, like, brother. Yeah. For, you know, with his white haired brother on this. <laughs> I, I don't I'm gonna I'm gonna go on the limb here and I'm gonna say I'm gonna say Gant and Dark aren't related. Um, okay. For one, okay, no, no. Like for one Dark just, is I the wouldn't be surprised. Too. I wouldn't be surprised all the twists and turns in this is like an episode of Coronation Street. <laughs> like yeah. Uh, Gant uh, was out sea swimming as he normally does every morning. He saw Joe Dark there and his togs and went, That's the man. That's the guy. That's the guy I want to be my murderer. <laughs> And it taught him everything he knew. Because <laughs> let's be honest, lads, sea swimmers are psychopaths. Like we are, we are, we are all agreed on that, yeah. Oh, okay. Again, she's saying land has not been the same since that case. Mm. I get the feeling Angel Star wants to spill some beans here. Rookie. I think we're still called. I think. I think. I like that we're still being called rookie, even though we've taken down the biggest prosecutor in human history. You know, just throwing it out there. Sky demon. Sky demons. Going for a swim. Yes, and only half of them, they actually faked it. <laughs> you know, metal things would just stick to them. <laughs> it's all coincidence that Damon Gant is played by Sir Ian McKellen. <laughs> that wouldn't be a bad shout, to be fair. Yeah, he could play it. He could, he could make it work. So Damon Gant apparently had this like incredible ability of finding critical evidence. You know, mm. we've all been there, lads. Just magically finding what we need at a crime scene. Tony Gates, much? <laughs> a bit of a, a bit of a, just a bit of a shout there, isn't it, Bertpot? Mm. Perhaps we are going to see a bit of a wee bit of laddering here at the, uh, <laughs> at, the at Criminal Affairs. Did you bring any yellow yellow paper with you, Mark Bob? Because I think we have to send out a few notices, if you know what I mean. Some Reg 15s. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're going all the fucking way, lads. Here we go. If we're not going to get Kant uh, through proper means, we're going to get him through the only way we know how. Paperwork. <laughs> and technicalities. <laughs> all right, mate. <laughs> all right, mate. All right, mate. All right, mate. Fancy a takeaway curry, mate. I think we should, I think I think from now on that is how we're gonna like introduce ourselves. All right, mate. All right, mate. All right, mate. <laughs> like from car, but like from car window, from like different cars. Like, all right, all right. <laughs> we're COVID and all that, lads. We still can't take the risk, you know. Okay. Yes. So just trying a few things here, but it looks like Star is uh, has said what she needs to say without uh, getting herself into trouble, as it were. Come to Oh, yeah, boy. Come by, come by. Come shoot. You're not going like this. Oh, well, have we got something for you, dear. <laughs> I would pay good money to have Gumshoe as my DJ. Just saying. <laughs> I'd say he played nothing but Phil Collins. Well, I was literally going to say it's just going to be middle of the road shit. <laughs> He's just playing Easy Lover for 20 minutes. <laughs> and he might play this like edgy weird one by this prince person don't know Ooh. might be too much for you that's a bit no that's a bit too fucking left can't have any of that liberal stuff on our on our playlist are you mad 
Okay, oh. we got the reaction we were looking for, but is he, are we going to get the action we're looking for? That, like, that's red rag to a bull there, isn't it? Like, look at the mouth. <laughs> if he could eat his own teeth, he would. He's as cold as I said. So he's going to have foreigner. Yeah. He would have foreigner. He would be he would be belting out foreigner. But, like, completely out of tune. <laughs> Tie around his head going, Oh, no, love is... Oh. <gasps> Always doing it. This, I'm now seeing these as like 80s rock lyrics. I yeah. As good as Terminator. <laughs> He's gonna, he's gonna sing Need Love through this entire investigation now. <laughs> and now I'll do anything for miles. <laughs> give you body heart. And like, okay. it, it, somewhere in the distance, Angel Star is like, oh, Meat Loaf? Why did I think of that? <laughs> <laughs> Just there, Franny writing, right. Rule one, Meat Loaf. Two, sit on Gumshoe's face. Done. <laughs> <laughs> Number three, set up OnlyFans page. Done. There we go. <laughs> now, so th finally, so Gumshoe's left. Oh, there he is. There. <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! Lightning panicking! Again. Panicking! Panicking! A ghost. Are you not more afraid of being caught in the chief's office by the chief? Again. Stop playing the organ. Yes. But I want it. Hey, 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 guys! Have you ever heard of this uh, this brand new uh, musical? It's called Phantom of the Opera. Don't fucking touch that! <laughs> I've got the I've got the mask and everything. Oh, you guys are no fun. <laughs> what with all this evidence? Yes. <laughs> We're all in this together now. More I was thinking more all together now, but yeah, I mean we can work that. We can we can work some nineties in there. Now let's have a, this is the chief's office. This is where shit went down two years ago. Let's have a goosey gander. But he even plays the organ as well. Yikes. That's that's awful. Oh my god. That is punishment to be fair. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. That's uh that is cruel and unusual. Swimming earplugs in. Maybe. So let's have a look at Gant's office, Gant's desk first. That's not suspicious at all. No, not one bit. Yes, I'm mine. <gasps> oh my god! I no. it. Yikes! It's happening! Size list of evidence. Oh. Oh. Edward said the same thing. Yeah, that's true. Really? 
You just figured that out. Well, you don't on. say. <laughs> so, let's have a look at that piece of paper. The additional stuff we're gonna find. <gasps> oh. oh shit. Look at that. Is that a crayon drawing? It is a crayon drawing. If I don't look, you'll be triggered. Yeah. Now again. She has described this to us before. Yeah. So there's a strong favor as to who could have drawn that on the back of the evidence list of this case. No, it's a safe. Nice. We always love safes here. Seven, 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 seven. <laughs> it's a seven digit number. He does have a hunch. <laughs> yeah, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, we're doing it. <laughs> oh, this is good. This is going to be good. Oh shit! Yeah! There we go. Now that confirms that confirms a few things, but <laughs> yes. Well, we need, like, that's not a surprise because Edward did say it was Gan that brought him to that, that to the evidence room. <laughs> oh yeah, let's do, let's do the whole like you know investigating the safe thing. No, let, let's just congratulate ourselves on guessing that number. Patting ourselves on the back. It, uh, what? <gasps> a shard from a broken cup. Ooh. A piece of leather cloth with a handprint on it. Oh, that was that was the only two things in the safe. Well, that's very unusual. Yes. Okay, fair point by gumshoe. So, if we want to steal from the chief, we have to show that they're important to the case. So, well, we've got the other part, the joke cook thing. That yes. We can show him. That's one. But the letter patch now was another thing. So we're gonna we're gonna get back to them. Let's let's have a look a uh, look around the rest of the office. So he has a a, a mighty fine suit of armor there. <laughs> I haven't even started yet. To be fair, that is a very, very like teenage view. It's like, oh, fuck the taxes. I'm not paying them. <laughs> oh, that would be great, wouldn't it? If it just pops up in the, in the armor. That'd be hilarious. Just like Scooby Doo episode. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Damon Gant, it was you? And I would have gotten away with it too if it wasn't for you meddling attorneys.
this is Solana's uh, desk, not as um, a lot more minimalist than uh, than Gans. Duh. That's an interesting line from uh, Phoenix there. Yeah. Look at that jug in the background. The jug in the background, yeah. There's the the trophy with the knight with the uh, with the sword in it, the broken sword. <laughs> it was a busy old day, all the same, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> That's there. He's just driving along. Then he mm -hmm. hit someone, then murdered someone, then murdered someone, then murdered someone, then murdered someone, then was brought into for questioning and murdered someone, and Nobody. then got murdered. I'm Don't you hate when you get like a bonus murder on your on your app sheet? <laughs> no, I do. So nothing apparently on the desk. But again, we are looking for evidence here. So. Let's go. combine some evidence. <laughs> it literally was yesterday. Mm hmm. <laughs> Connect the dots. Come on, he's going to get there. Yeah, give him a second. My God, he got it. Oh, so, God. Yeah. Triggered by uh, memories of the Ripper. <laughs> oh, this one isn't as bad. Like the... Okay. I can sing uh, Don't Fear the Reaper if that makes you feel better. Sing the instrumental version. <laughs> it looks like there's blood on it. It does look like there's blood on it. That's kind of like trophy esque. It is. And he has concealed a piece of evidence from the investigation. And Gumshoes just noticed what you noticed. Yeah. There's dry blood on it. It is blood. Dried blood. Hmm. It's a real mystery, that, isn't it? Gum shoes, obviously. <laughs> so the whole incident with Marshall took took place on her side of the of this massive fuck off office. That is very weird. That is, yeah. <laughs> so, he, so he's preserved that he's preserved that crime scene for two years. That side of the that side of the office is, hasn't been touched since fucking since the murder. Like, do you not think she'd want her stuff from her desk? Yeah, I, I guess so, but like, there didn't seem to be much there to begin with. Alas, <laughs> go on, go shooting big. 
Go on. Go on, my son. <laughs> <laughs>